It's currently 4.54 in the morning. I'm up because today is the first day of Wimbledon. Wimbledon. Tradition. Timeless. Immortal. You cannot be serious! There's a new champion at Wimbledon. No back, Djokovic. There she is, a new name, a new champion, Yelena Rimaikana. I am working on the editing team for Wimbledon for my job, so of course I am on the United Kingdom time. Fun day ahead though. I love tennis and I'm very excited for Wimbledon. I'm very tired though. <laughs> Not off to a hot start on this Monday. Just got off the phone with IT uh, because Windows password, I had to change my password um, or whatever every three months. And uh, yeah, Windows was like, yeah, I don't believe you after I changed it. And uh, then it was corrupt. It's so much fun. Dude, I was so worried because I'm working from home and I thought I was gonna have to pack up my stuff and make and do the long drive in. Oh my gosh, thank God. Thank you to whoever helped me on IT. You saved my life today. Um, I've been working on this, I'm not kidding, for it's 6.10 now. <laughs> so this has been, since, since 4.50 this morning, I have been dealing with this. It has not been fun at all. Okay, work finally finished, and now I can get into what I wanted to talk about today, and that is this thing. The DJI lapel mic system, an amazing piece of technology that screwed me over the other day. I love this thing. I love the DJI lapel mic. It is so sick. It's such a sick kit, but oh my God, did it ever let me down the other day. It was so stupid in that vlog with the bikes. Unfortunately, I plugged it into my iPhone, it worked for two seconds, and then nothing. And then now, I can't get it to work at all. It doesn't even recognize it. Even though, when I put the connector in for the DJI in the receiver, I put the iPhone connector in, it shows on the, D on the receiver that it's plugged in and connected, but nothing on my iPhone. I have tried it every which way. There's four pins, there's eight pins all together on the receiver, and then there's four on the iPhone. And then on the USB-C, there's the whole eight to match right up with the receiver. I don't know why there's only four on the iPhone. I'm sure there's some technical stuff in there. And there's reasons that I don't know why. Uh, but for some reason, it does not connect at all. <laughs> and I've read every forum possible. Actually, this is like a big issue. I see so many people saying, oh, it's completely unusable. You can use it with DJI's app, the Mimo app or something like that. I didn't even, I tried that, I downloaded it for two seconds, I couldn't even figure out how to record on it. Um, but yeah, it was such a letdown because, so how it registers on the iPhone when you plug it in, it registers as a headset. So it takes up your headphone port. So your volume thing looks like headphones. And when you plug it in, any iPhone user will know how when you plug in headphones or anything, or you connect AirPods, it asks you, it, like your playlist comes up on your home screen. It shows like, do you want to play music? So I saw that come up for about two seconds. And then when I actually started recording with it, nothing. Did not work. Thankfully, the, uh, the footage was not a complete and total waste because it somehow worked out with the way I was vlogging during that biking uh, episode of this vlog. So I'm happy about that, but I'm super disappointed because now I have this device that I was hoping to work alongside it would be one of my primary uses for this you know piece of equipment and it doesn't work and it's so disappointing so please dji can you please find a way to fix it even if it's like a firmware update or maybe you know what add the other four pins make it eight pins on the iphone who knows maybe it'll work i'm a technological genius and that's why you know if you want to send me a check for my advice i'll give you my i'll give you my address and you can hit me up no, but in all seriousness, this is an amazing product and I would recommend it to everyone, but now I'm a little hesitant to anyone that's trying to use it with mobile. Now, my buddy, his he bought it for a birthday present for his wife and she's using it with her Android phone. She has a Samsung or something or whatever she has, but it works perfectly because the USB-C connection works perfectly with those eight connectors that match up perfectly with the receiver 
Again, don't know why the iPhone doesn't have that uh, on, on the adapter, but you know what? I'm happy that works. So I'm really hoping that the iPhone 15 just has USB-C and lightning ports can be a thing of the past and just phase out over the next five to 10 years. That'd be amazing. Because again, like these are amazing audio quality. When I hook it up to my camera, I do nothing. I literally just have to plug it in and turn it on and turn on the mic and boom, here I am talking to you. It's so great and it's so useful. Now, like I said, obviously I bought the shotgun mic because, you know, it's not always the perfect thing for every situation, but for the most part, I love this thing. I recommend it to everyone up until what just happened. Also, side note, just while we're on the topic of these microphones, I see everybody wearing them like this. This is how I see everyone wear them, okay? On their shirt like that. Cool, nothing wrong with that. You can do that if that's your cup of tea. However, just a side note, when I see a lot of people wearing them on the outside of their shirt, they wear it with the windscreen on it. Okay, so instead, put it inside your shirt. You minimize it, it's more incognito. All you see is like the little magnetic clip on the outside and your shirt is gonna act like a windscreen and you're still gonna get great audio. Plus like, why wouldn't you wanna hide the microphone and make it like less noticeable, kinda look like a show? That's just me. Hey, what can I say? I'm so Hollywood, but yeah. So please DJI again, fix this damn issue because it, it's such an amazing product. And as long as it works with iPhone or you know what, Apple just stop making stupid lightning ports and crap that, you know, stop working in your own little bubble. Just make it a lot more accessible for all users. That'd be awesome too. All right, cool. Thank you. Rant over. Look at that. That's what a hero looks like. <laughs> Medea saved the camera because I'm way too trusting of this tripod, so I stuck it in there and it fell. But Medea caught it, so barbecue done, vlog done.